drink the water before I drink the coffee okay so gotta drink all this water Um, as you guys saw, I did the bed while I'm listening to Gratitude Affirmations, do my cleaning while I'm doing this, and I'm now I'm just gonna go keep on with the rest of the house. I do the bed the first because as I wake up, if I do the bed, it's like I feel accomplished already. And then the next thing is like kitchen and bathroom, and the last thing, the living room. And then I just feel like I'm fine in order, I can start my day. Then I'll go have a shower and just get myself ready after the house is ready. But um, right now, baby Trinity, she fell asleep again. And my partner is watching some TV and I'm just finishing to clean. Hi guys, so hi. <laughs> we are back here. Trinity is changed. She's ready to bed. What time is it now? I think it's about 6 p.m. or something like that. I um I actually recorded today already. I'm gonna show you guys my setup. So here's my setup, my computer. I was going live. I got my books here in case I need them. I got some notes in there in case I need them. This is my beautiful money plant, which I love, and I love to be next to it as well. All my plants in the background, and I have here this 
lights that I bought in Amazon that to be honest this is a life changer if you're in this YouTube game you gotta get one of these because if literally I, I have it for a long time and I didn't start using it till like few you know days ago when I started to plan to go live and all of that and I think it's really nice it really helps So today is the first day we are starting our routine with baby Trinity! Hi Trinity! So we are going to go to bed and I'm going to read the Bible with her in the bed. Just a few, you know, chapters, not much. And till she falls asleep and I'm bringing a book with me in case you know she falls asleep and I'm interested in keep reading I'm just gonna start to do that as a routine as something that I usually do I wanted to go for a daily walk and I haven't gone to be honest and now it's getting a bit late 7.15 and I still have to cook dinner and I want to put her to sleep and have this bonding time with you know just me and her reading in the bed while she you know till she falls asleep and then i'm going to cook for dinner and i started going live and today i, I did an episode where i was talking about chakras it was interesting you guys have this video there today if you want so that's why i'm kind of like ready to go out but i just go ready to record and yeah Basically, that's what happens. Let's go. Okay, I stopped to vlog this morning because um, the battery died. And yes, I basically finished to clean. Then I had a shower with Trinity. We both had a shower together. This is really nice. I started to do it recently. And I enjoy the experience. It's better than have her in the bath because in this way we can both just get the job done in one goal. And then after that, it's just getting her ready and dressing her, feeding her and all of that. So yeah, now she's feeding and she's going to be feeding for a while. She was hungry. I, I was not sure if she was, had gases, if she was hungry or if something was happening. But yeah, oh, she's feeding on that side and this side is leaking. So I'm just going to put my finger on it so it can stop. But mm -hmm, it's complicated to breastfeed because you have to breastfeed like literally every every like three hours now she's sleeping through the night now so that's really amazing i'm happy about that she sleeps at least four or five hours so that's the only sleep it's not even the only sleep i have because usually i'm still awake when she goes to sleep through the night because now she may sleep like for an hour few minutes like half an hour wake up sleep again wake up but then at night night when we all kind of like in bed she sleeps for five night five hours so that's really good we're getting something done and me i'm just managing you know managing to start back working again like you know what i mean like working on projects and my goals and just getting back on track on routines and all of that 
because it's, it's happening and I'm happy about that. I'm taking it easy, you know, because it's complicated to just bring a child to this world and then, you know, like, it's complicated. I gotta enjoy her too. She's just so cute. So she already fell asleep, so now it's my break time. I'm gonna put her to bed and you know change my clothes because literally the side of my dress is completely wet. And yeah, just change my clothes and prepare dinner and yeah start preparing the dinner but I'll show you now what we're doing today She woke up again and I did some tummy time with her and I did some tummy time with her in the bedroom as well and because she don't want to sleep again and don't want to stay by herself I'm going to you know put some educational thing on the computer for her and we played for a little bit, we read a little bit, we took her gases out, we did all of that and she slept for about half an hour time that I was reading too and as soon as I was going to start cooking she woke up so okay so now i'm going to put her to watch something and i'm going to try to cook <laughs> quiet now and hopefully I can cook um, doing something on the air fryer with some chicken uh, with potatoes on the air fryer and I'm just gonna get started with the chicken onion So let's just get this chicken clean. And clean. By the way, um, we have been in a juice detox diet for seven days. Today is the seventh day, and as a record for having done so well during the seven days, we're just gonna have some chicken. It's Sunday, so it's kind of like a Sunday roast, but we're making it in the air fryer, which is going to be way healthier than if it's in the oven or if it's in a fryer so that's good it's not gonna have much oil or nothing so we're trying to just clean up our body and start again like healthy lifestyle and all of these kind of things um 
And yeah, this is what we're doing today, this chicken. So I'm going to... Okay, I'm gonna leave the chicken here cleaning. I clean it when I clean the chicken. I like to add a little bit of lemon in the water just so it kills any bacteria that may be out there or something. Just like to eat the meat really clean. Um, really, I wanna stop eating meat really soon. I'm cooking this more for Jamai. Of course, I will have a little bit, but. Yeah, I, I don't want to eat meat anymore because I have been feeling so good after I started this diet. Guys, you don't even believe it. Like, I have changed. I'm more active. I'm doing things that I always wanted to do for a long time. But I was always putting excuses. Things like that. I feel like it's changing me. So, yeah, I'm not doing more. This is our own time per week eating meat. <laughs> so, we bought the air fryer. The fryer came with this, came with these recipe books, um, and I'm going to try to do a recipe today. So it's some bros recipe. I'm going to have a look at bros on what they have here. Let's see. I have a bunch of things, even pizza you can do, chicken, stuff like that. So I'm gonna choose to do like a roast thing or something. Let's see what they have the content in here. Okay, so this is the recipe that I want to do. It's a roast chicken garlic herbs. 35 minutes and it's going to be just uh, I'm going to do this recipe. If you guys interested, I will link the recipe down below, but for now I'm just going to cook this chicken with this recipe and I'll show you how it looks later. sesame seed oil I use this oil because it smells so good and it's a bit healthier than you know rest of the oils and seasoning I'm just going to basically salt and pepper all proper seasoning like everything that I have available to be honest like I like this the chicken very very nice season so yeah I'll do that and also add the garlic and the lemon I'm gonna leave the chicken marinating for about a few minutes, don't know, 20 minutes more or less, and tidy up the kitchen because it's a bit, you know, it's not messy but it's a bit disorganized and yeah, gotta get it clean and yeah, just that, wait for the chicken to marinate and then we can start to cook. So now I'm going to start cleaning while Trinity is listening to the Lunabye songs and try to sleep it's been quite difficult to start implementing this routine but i'm doing it pretty well so far i really like to go live i started going live i think that's a good part of my routine you know trying to have her shower she 
you know, clean, is happy, is fed, is, you know, try, we try to make her sleep, she don't want to sleep, so I'm going to leave her there. And we're trying slowly, slowly to make her sleep, you know, on her, on her own bed, but sometimes it's hard, so I have to make her sleep with me, and after that I put her in the bed and this is what we're trying to do but they do recommend in the book i'm reading they recommend that you put the baby in the in the young bed kind of like half asleep half awake i try to do that it's very difficult with her so far because she's just a week so she still is kind of need me a little bit a lot <laughs> and yeah it's a nice feeling to feel needed but it's also very demanding because I can't literally do anything <laughs> like you know I try and I get to do something sometimes but it's hard to manage time but yeah it's good so far she's doing amazing she's being you know really quiet and really good baby in general and I'm learning to multitask so I'm learning to do the mom job and it's it's very rewarding for real um yeah i don't know are you guys starting a family as well or are you planning to okay so jamai ordered some food for the house it just came with the delivery you know the delivery guy comes and brings the food to the door trinity is so happy here look at her baby hi Hello. She just have hip hip cups right now, and she had a little bit of gases. And I love to take her and cuddle her and she's so happy in me, in, with me as well and I just like to have her on me um, as much time as I can to be honest and just give me so much love Oh, my friend sent me a picture of um, Mary and Oliver are getting married ah! They sent me a picture. Oh my gosh, where is my phone? I don't know. I left it in the room, I think. But it's so lovely. He proposed to her and she said yes. And I'm so happy for them though. That was really cute. Probably we'll have a wedding soon. So yeah. Adam, oh, you guys are gonna make, get to meet her as well. She's my trainer, and I wanna start working out really soon. The juice diet went really well this week. We really didn't eat much food. We only had juices. We had at least one solid food per day, but the solid food was basically fruits and vegetables. I mean, it was vegetables and maybe pasta, something like that. And it's not because we're trying to save money or nothing like that even though it's very cheap to do this diet it's just because you know i read that book um that book that i told you the reboot detox or something like that the fat um sick and over almost dead uh, which was based in a movie that had a lot of success and I watched the oh my, I bought the book first in a charity shop and then I watched the movie and then I was just like okay let's do this and I started and I realized that yes it's true you eat fruits and vegetables and nuts in the smoothies or juices and it gives you so much energy that you don't even need solid food you don't even need it for real like your stomach don't even need it I'm just starting to clean up and clean cleans and I start feeling really good and I'm so happy that I'm starting to get healthy and back into a routine when and now she's two months so I can exercise and I want Mari to come and do me a class 
per week because she's a personal trainer so we're gonna get her to do that and come and visit us once per week to do like just a, some exercise she sent me a sheet that I need to fill up and I was supposed to fill it up I just took a little bit longer than I thought but it's fine because I'm still recovering and you know partum is a really stressful thing that not many people actually gives importance to it I believe and and yeah I, I am still recovering I'm not perfect yet and things doesn't feel the same down there neither so it's complicated and even though I want to exercise, I'm just now finding the time to get back to work, to get back to edit, to get back to, you know, feeling myself like again, we will start this program really soon. Just fitness, lifestyle, all of trying to put in the channel some health stuff, fitness, exercise, some educational stuff as well. And I'm even thinking about do like a Bible reading, like in the mornings, like when I wake up because bible is really nice i didn't know but yeah someone gave me this bible in the street one day and it's like the bible but i just wrote it with a kind of like a modern language and i am so happy you know because i understand everything and it's very interesting i enjoy a lot and i think because i'm already reading it for myself why not share it with you guys and do like a bible study like bible reading once a day just coming in the morning or something like that reading a little bit of the bible going live of course and then from there just post that because spirituality is one of the areas more important of life and in my life is very important and even though all the more like spiritual side like scientific side like you know the law of attraction and affirmations and quantum physics and the study of the universe and all of this i also believe spirituality comes from not from religious but from religious books like the bible or the quran or you know buddha kind of like philosophy anything it really have an essence like something there is something in the world like there's something that they are teaching you that you won't learn otherwise like and the world kind of programming you to be go against this world and this world is a kind of like a manual for your mind is a manual of how to use your mind how to you know understand your mind and your body and your thoughts and it's interesting and i want to get more in deep into it into the bible because i was raised reading the bible basically in a christian family and it's not even about the religious side i swear it's more about the spiritual side and the the guide that you find in the world you won't find you won't find it nowhere else and the world is programming you to basically forget it and don't go there and i think with me going there if I share it with the world, with the internet, and you guys can see it too and can benefit from it, it would be good. Yeah, I feel inspired, really inspired. I don't know if it's this nice Luna Bay songs in the in the in the background, but sometimes you know things are way easier than we than we wanna know. Like things are way easier than we think when we start thinking forward, thinking like more simplistic, more positive, more minimalistic, things start happening. Trinity is about to almost fall asleep, almost on it, almost almost. She almost got it. So let's, let's wait a few minutes more. Like for example, today I started reading Proverbs, the Proverbs, the that David, I think it was David who wrote my uh, proverbs, and the way it's wrote, the way the word is speaking to you, towards you, and literally teaching you what to do, and you kind of know is the truth as well, and it's just a guidance to of how how to live, how to manage your mind, your thoughts, how to you know know how to manage through life, and how to understand not just you but also other people and i am and i like a lot how it's like some parts is speaking to you like for example talk about the foolishness the the weak 
but also talks about wisdom, about, you know, marriage, women in general. I made a way to make us a way, our family a way, a way we can stay. Please, please, look at me, be with us. <laughs> Trinity, the light is on me now. Look <laughs> at our face. It really hard. <laughs> they will not be in our place. They do it. <laughs> 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 that song for both of us, Trinity. Are you listening? <laughs> Nine months before you came, <laughs> we weren't where we wanted to be, but we worked hard every day to make a family. Hmm? That's true, yeah? What else you want? Oh, I want to know. <laughs> oh, we look good today, that's right. It's because of us. Okay, wait. <laughs> what? You want me to tell them? Yeah. No, you, you can't say that. Don't forget the salt and the pepper. Don't remember, please don't put chicken in the blender. Please make it hot in the oven. But we got an air fryer like fucking Sunday. So we're gonna use the air fryer. No stove, no ladder. I don't need a buyer. All I need is this hot chicken on the fire. So yeah, uh, daddy arrived and now he's doing some bonding time with the baby and I'm going to feed her again and um, hopefully she falls asleep this time for a long time, at least like three, four hours and let's see. But yeah, the chicken looks good though and yeah, just the jama is so funny, it makes me laugh so much. <laughs> But yeah, let me let me get Trinity to feed her in a bit.
Hey guys, this is Z guys. Now, I'm gonna put her to sleep. And in a bit, we're going to have dinner. And our day is over. Then we're gonna chill out for a bit. Just we two. So enjoy some time as a couple. And after that, just, you know, maybe she wake up again, maybe not. Hopefully not. And we can go to sleep and usually we sleep quite late today as part of the new routine i'm going to try to go to bed earlier but i don't know how it's gonna work but thank you so much for hanging out with me today and with the baby we love you so much okay. just washing some rice <laughs> 